Hello my friends, this is Iggy back again. Today we're going to be doing an unboxing and a brief overview of the XFX Radeon RX 5600 XT 6GB GDDR6 Thick 2 Pro. Model number RX 56 XT 6D F46. So we can see along the front here, just the model number, the card, along the side, minimum specs, just some marketing back here and some marketing over here. So let's go ahead and open up the card. All right, and you can see right off the bat on the cardboard, they have their XFX imprint. And yet another box inside the box. Oh, okay. This is just to keep it safe during shipping. There's nothing in there. Ah, look at that. All right, so they do include, in case your power supply does not have a single 8-pin, which this card requires a single 8-pin, they include in the box two 6-pin PCIe's to a single 8-pin PCIe. This video card requires 450 watts, but they recommend a 500 watt. All right, then the XFX warranty card, support information. Here they're gonna go over how to install it, basics on that, and then some adapters and everything. And I'll go ahead and list that down below as well as the Amazon affiliate link to this card. All right, some troubleshooting, insulation, and all that good stuff. They also include in here, they're replacing XFX hardware swap fan. So that's nice, they also have that feature. Stop, important driver information. No driver disc included in this box. All right, so you got to download it from the internet, but no worries. I'll show you guys how to do that and where to get it. I'm going to set this aside just for right now, just to make sure there's nothing else in this box. Phone, nothing else. All right, so just put that aside for now. And we have the cart itself. This is a very nice looking card their XFX logo over here, before you install it, actually when you take it out of the box. So you don't forget, make sure you take off all of this and I'll be quiet in case it sounds nice. Not as nice as I would have wanted, but that's okay. And I think they have it over here too. So yeah, take them off from both of these. All right, and then they have some more up here along the back. Doesn't sound as sexy. Oh, this one's on plastic. And then they have more. I'm making sure they keep this card nice and pretty for you guys. And one more along the bottom. This one's hidden, so make sure you pull it out. All right. Now we have this sexy looking card with their bronze XFX accents right over here. You can see their heat pipe here. This is a slim, sexy card, yet it's the thick two. All right. And again, XFX branding right over here. You can see their copper heat pipes there. I really like the look of this card. XFX along the back. This is a metal back plate, so nice. The card, as I mentioned before, does require one eight pin PCIe connection. Yes, you do need to connect it. It's nice the way they kind of hit it back there, but you will need to connect it. And again, they require a 450 watt power supply, but they do recommend a 500 watt power supply. And I mentioned the 
XFX bronzing right over here, but I did forget to mention this is a dual fan configuration. I definitely love that. Not a big fan of the blower style or a single fan, dual fan or triple fan even, but this is nice. Almost feels like a blower car, but obviously they have two fans here. Interesting to see how well this cools. And I will do a complete install video and a review and all that good stuff. But uh, down here we can see the fins. Okay, we can see right along here, they have three display ports and one HDMI. Now the display ports are 1.4 with DSC 1.2A and HDR. The HDMI is 2.0B and has a max digital resolution and streaming resolution of 8K HDR at 60 Hertz. This is a PCIe by four card, but of course it will support older generations, PCI 3.0. And let's see, definitely remove this before you attempt to install the card and try not to touch those gold contacts. The oil from your fingertips and everything can potentially degrade the contact with the PCIe slot. This card is powered by AMD second gen 7 nanometer RDNA architecture with a GPU boost clock of 1620 megahertz and a game clock of up to 1560 megahertz. Again, this comes with 6 gigabytes of 192 bit GDDR6 at 14 gigabits per second effective, 2,304 streaming cores. As you can see, this is a dual slot card. While it only takes up one physical PCIe slot, it will cover the other. As you can see here, a maximum of four displays. HDMI will go up to 4096 by 2160 at 60 Hertz, and the display ports will reach 5120 by 2880 at 60 Hertz. Now again, PCIe by four. As long as your motherboard supports EUFI, you will be able to use PCIe 3.0. So this is meant for extreme 1080p gaming, the resolution that most of us do play at. And it supports Radeon Rays Audio and True Audio Next, AMD Affinity, Radeon Boost, Radeon FreeSync 2 HDR, which is so beautiful to have, intelligent sharpening technology, all right? And again, I am going to make another video right after this, showing you guys how to install the card into your machine, including the drivers and all that good stuff. And then I will be showing you the performance of the card. So make sure to click like and subscribe and the little bell notification icon. That way you know when I come out with that video and videos just like it. All right guys, that's about it for now. Again, this is Iggy doing an unboxing of the XFX Radeon RX 5600 XT 6 gigabyte GDDR6 Thick 2 Pro RX 56 XT6 DF46 Iggy out. See you guys.